Hi, my grade two friends. Um, mm -hmm. I hope that you're doing your work and you're having, um, staying healthy, staying safe. Um, so today what we're going to do is on Tuesday, you were supposed to um, or, uh, categorize words, um, put them into an analogy chart um, with a long A sound and then write some sentences. Today we're gonna just go through some of those words quickly. We're gonna go through those words. Um, we're gonna read some sentences and we're gonna read a passage that has to practice reading words with vowel teams, okay? So um, let's take a look. I hope you can see my screen here. Let's look at that first one. A-Y says A, don't forget, okay? A-Y says A. So we have, we're gonna go right down in the columns, okay? Play, way, J, fray. Now look at this one, play time. Good, next one, hey, stray. A, sway, haystack, may, say, ray, clay, playmate, stay, hey, gray, bray, subway, spray, day, tray, lay, pray, Sunday. Good job. Let's look here, okay? Say, not, skin, play, day, ash, lunch, lied, take, went, state, stay, gray, Bin, hatch, lay, home, pay, spend, risk, note, scrap, skill, plate, clay. Now I'm going to give you a time to read some of these sentences, okay? Read that first one together. Sunday is the best day. Your turn. Next one. This is a fun game to play. Your turn. Good. I like to ride the subway. Ray will take Liz to the play. I like to stay inside on a hot day. Did you pay the man in the store? Notice how my voice went up because it's a question. Try doing that one again. Did you pay the man in the store? Next one. The gray cat lay on the bed. Your turn. The day went by fast. The hen will lay an egg. Jay is on one of my is one of my playmates. Great. Now we're going to read a story called The Subway Ride. Kay likes to ride the subway, but not Claire. She hates it. When they go to Graham's, Kay and Claire must take the subway. They both love to be with Graham, so they want to go. This will be a fun day, said Kay. I love to ride the subway. Maybe you do, said Claire, but subway rides scare some of us. Just stay by my side, said Kay. I have a map. I hope we do not get lost, said Claire. There are all those stops. When will we get off? I will tell you, I have the subway map, said Kay. Claire, here is the subway line we want. Get on and stay close to me. Kay and Claire got on. They sat side by side. As the subway sped up, the map fell. It sat there. Claire had to pick it up. 
Kay, she said, we have, the, we have to have this map. Do you want to stay on the subway all day long? Maybe, said Kay. I love to ride the subway. I told you that. Well, I hate it, said Claire. So today I will hold the map. Kay had to smile. You do that, she said as the subway came to a stop. Is this the stop we want? You have to say, Claire, you have the map. With a yell, Claire gave the map back to Kay. Six stops went by. Then Kay said to get off. She was sad to get off the subway, but Claire was quite glad. Now, what I would like you guys to do is the same type of activity that you did on Tuesday. I would like you to do an analogy chart and find the words um, from the story, okay? So one side would have a y and the other one will have a consonant e. So the first one, for example, if I start here, I might put subway in the first column because it has a y. Okay? I could then put k in there. That one also has a y. Claire would go on the other side. It has a consonant e. Okay, so I'm going to keep, I want you to go back, take a look through this passage and find all the words that have a y and a consonant e. Take a picture of it and send it to your teacher. Have a great day.